Are you putting your Surface Pro in the freezer to stop screen flickering issues like an idiot? Well stop doing that with this solution to solve the screen flickering without the need of doing this. So here's how to fix the screen flickering issue. Most of the time it happens on a monochromatic color such as black or white. But let's fix this. So first thing you do is you go to device manager. Now some people are saying that this is a hardware issue, but I believe it's a software issue. But this is where you go to first. You go to display adapters, as you can see right here. So with this one, you right click it and you hit uninstall device. You make sure to click delete this driver software for the device and uninstall it. I've already done this, so I will not do this again because it's a little tedious, but make sure you do that. So once you hit the install, then you will have to restart your computer. So after you restart it, you will come back to this. And here, under display adapters, it will no longer have Intel HD graphics. Um, it will now have Microsoft display adapter and you will notice that there will be no flickering at all. So what that happened is actually this driver is corrupted. So there are two solutions to fix this. My favorite one is the surface reset button. So how you do that is you press, you hold the power button down for 30 seconds. And as you can tell, now it's shut down. Now, what you do is you hold both the volume up button and the power button at the same time. And keep holding it down. So it will have the surface icon. It'll come up with this. Keep holding it. It'll go black again. It'll have the surface icon. And there you go. For safekeeping, I would keep it on for a few minutes. or just, And you can circle through all these and stuff like that. Then hit exit, restart now, and load back up your computer. Alright, and then, this is the tricky part right here. So, with this step you will have the brightness very bright on your computer if it was set at a dim level or whatever but keep your surface on for quite some time because it is going to install the Intel HD 515 driver while you so let me log in all right we're back online. So if you go to device manager, you will still see the Intel, you will not see the Intel um, HD graphics as you will see. You will still see the Microsoft one. However, it will start installing it. It might take five to 10 minutes. If you still do not see it, make sure to either do action Scan for hardware changes, and if that doesn't pick up, you will look up Intel HD Graphics 515 on your Bing or Google search engine, and then download it from Intel's main site. So take for example, if we look, if we start up Edge, Intel 515 HD Graphics. So here, and then you. this is the download center for Intel. Make sure to do that. Now, if you want to be very precautious, you can download it from the Microsoft driver's site, but this one would suffice as well. So this has been a Tech Rich video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe because as of February, the end of February, I will not be making any money off of these videos as my subscriber count is not at 1,000. If you could... Please increase my subscriber account. I would greatly enjoy it because I love making these videos 
I love finding solutions for things that have not been solved. Thank you so very much for watching and have a great day.